This week, one of the ACC's, the distance group is led by Connor Adams, our freshman. He's broke the school record twice this season, so we're looking for, you know, a strong performance for him, um, making the final in the mile, which would be huge for our program. Um, and the throws events were led by Miranda, seniors Miranda Wilson and also um, Ashley Holmes. Uh, we look for strong performances in the weight from Miranda and Ashley and the shot from Ashley. Um, going into the sprints, the women are led by Tarika Williams. Um, you know, she has a uh, she's the defending ACC champ in the 200 meters. A lot of competition for her to defend her title, but we're excited about you know getting to Boston on a fast track and really performing well. You know, she's really excited to defend her title and you know run fast this weekend. And then our men's sprinters and hurdlers are led by um, Devon Hill. Uh, he's the two-time defending champion in the 60-meter hurdles, and again, a lot of competition going into this weekend. Both of those events, the women's sprints and the men's hurdle, are probably two of the stronger events in the conference. I think it'll be a great experience for our athletes to be in Boston and be in a metropolitan area as opposed to, you know, a college town like Blacksburg. Um, it's always nice, too, because it gives you an opportunity for athletes from different parts of the country, so maybe some families from the Northeast can come visit and watch the championships. Um, but it's a great facility. There's a lot of room to warm up, so I think it's a really good championship venue, and I think you're going to see a lot of great performances come out of the meet this weekend. Mm -hmm. You can tell the difference this week between the freshmen that don't really know what to expect and Devon and, and Tarika who, uh, I mean, Day Day came to practice with just a completely different attitude yesterday. I mean, it was on on Monday, you know, so you can tell he's got that championship mode. And Tarika too, you know, she's got that quiet confidence and, um, you know, they both know they've got to run well to defend their title. For um, uh, three people, actually, um, Nicole Cummins in the multis and the long jump. I, I think she has an opportunity to have a really big championship. She jumps well at the Tyson meet, mm -hmm. um, so I think she has a chance to have a breakout. And we're also looking for some pretty strong performances in the women's weight throw with Miranda and Ashley. They're ready to throw far, so I think probably those three performances. I mean, you always, that's a track meet. You always have, somebody always steps up when you're not expecting it. And so hopefully we have a lot of those, but you know, I look for those three, you know, we're really hoping that they can put it together this weekend and have a good, a good championship. I think this whole indoor season's been a learning experience. Um, you know, it's they've already run longer than they ran their whole high school career, and it's, we haven't even started outdoor yet. So it's just, you know, it's a challenge to keep them motivated, to keep them positive. Um, but I think they have great attitudes. They come out, they work hard every day. So I think every week is a learning experience. Um, so I'm looking for them to finish the season off on a good note.